Get into the sports news as security agencies continue to register crucial successes in the war against violent livestock robbers terrorizing communities in northern Kenya. The Cabinet Secretary for Interior and National Administration Kithure Kindiki now says that Operation Maliza Uhalifu will go on for as long as it takes to end banditry and livestock theft. Kindiki said this in Isiolo County where he also warned security agents against facilitating banditry saying they would face painful legal consequences. 11 months after starting Operation Maliza Uhalifu, Cabinet Secretary for Interior Kithure Kindiki has hated the war against bandits and stock theft, this time telling them the exercise will go on for eternity should it be necessary. This is even after residents pleaded against the operation for fear of collateral damage of innocent civilians in the hands of security forces conducting the operation. <laughs> Operation ya miezi sita, operation nisijui ya siku ngapi, safari hii. Ile operation tunaleta huku ni operation ya milewe. Aishi. While overseeing the return of livestock previously stolen by bandits in Isiolo County, Kindiki also issued a warning to chiefs and other security officers suspected of aiding and facilitating rustlers in banditry prone areas. <laughs> Kwa hivyo tutakutoa kwanza, ndio utoa uniform kwanza, tukustaki, tukufuta kazi, alamu tubaki na ule jambazi peke yake tutamalizana na hei. Kindiki at the same time also promised monetary and rank rewards to officers who would attend to their duties diligently. Una saidiana na wale ya mawa na usika sisi zote, mifuga inapatikana. Wakora wanapatikana wale ambao wameumiza wananchi. Tutakupandisha cheo, tutakupatia national honors, na tutatavuta pesa tukupatia adharani kama za wadi ili tukuweke mbukicha. Kindiki's visit to Isiolo comes one week after announcing that Operation Maliza Uhalifu will be extended to parts of Meru, Isiolo and Marsabit. Governor.